Hello guys, back with another video. Uh, in this uh, series of uh, videos uh, or tutorials, we will be uh, learning about all the methods, all the popular methods in JavaScript. It is very extremely important to know because whenever you are dealing with uh, web development and you are using JavaScript as a client-side programming language, it is uh, really good to know to all good to know all the methods in javascript so here we are and uh, we will be learning in this video we will be learning about two fixed uh, method so before before diving deep into that method ju uh, just i ask to subscribe to my channel so that whenever i come up with uh, crash courses tutorials technology related uh, videos and how to's and all of the things so that you will be notified and also click that bell button uh, so that you will be notified whenever i come up with the videos right so now uh, let's move ahead and uh, start developing and start knowing about uh, the method called as two fix right so quickly open the html tag because we are dealing with html and javascript in the client side so in the title i'll just say two fixed because this is what the function which we are dealing now so in the body i will just open the script tag and of course the title and the type should be text slash javascript because we are dealing with javascript so it's very simple and i'll just declare some uh, variable called as number and i will assign some uh, some random uh, number to that just like this and a semicolon and uh, just i will just before dealing with anything i'll just console it to the log and verify whether it's working or not in the in the console right so i'll just save this and come up here refresh the page and go to the developer tools and <clears throat> Here we are, we got this random number, right? So now I'll just copy this, right? And I'll paste it over here. So instead of doing this, what I will be doing here is number dot to fixed. As you can see, this is a function. And in this function or, or else the method. So this method, guys, what do you mean by this to fixed? So this is the method which converts all the, the decimal number with the decimal points to the fixed number of uh, formats so if i just specify two as a parameter it will just print only 158 dot now 12 that's it so after two uh, after this decimal point we need to get two numbers or two digits right so i'll just save this and refresh it back again in the browser boom we got is got this right so this parameter specifies the number of digit that must be uh, with the this whole number right so i'll just copy this again and uh, i'll just paste it over here and just check it with the another uh, parameter as four right so come back here refresh and we got the four digits after the decimal point so now guys what if we specify uh, a, a max number more than the the, uh, the digit itself so now we have five digits after the decimal points if we give us seven what happens now so i'll just uh, check it out and save this file come back and refresh and as you can see it will print all the numbers or i mean sorry yeah digits in after the decimal points and it will append the remaining uh, with the zero so since we have given seven and it will be a uh, seven digits after decimal points and since there is only five in our case it has appended two uh, zeros at the end right so it will fix all the numbers at the end right so this is it and what if now the question is the next scenario is what if we don't give any parameters here so let's check it out and come back to the browser refresh it and we get only the 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 whole number right so this is the the integer this is not a decimal point number this is just an integer so if you don't give any uh, uh, parameter it will just give us the number which is after you know before the decimal point right so this is the sex uh, the next scenario and come back and we'll just uh, go ahead with another uh, scenarios like I'll just instead of giving the numbers I will just say something called as 156 uh, uh let's say e which is an exponential plus uh, 10 so now what happens to this so again guys we are dealing with the variable here and we can of course we can have directly the 
the number itself right so I'll just save this and come back to the browser and refresh this and as you can see it will do this so this is the whole number which we have given in the form of exponential and after that after decimal point we have specified two and we have got the the two zeros appended after the decimal point so this is what happens if we use uh, uh, an exponential uh, format of a number and i'll just copy this and again I'll come back with another scenarios where instead of plus i'll just give minus and i'll save this off and uh, yeah refresh this and we got 0 0.22 i'm sorry 0 0.00 so this is how it works guys the the function too fixed and if i change change it to four and we'll get the four digits appended after the decimal point yes guys this is all about the all the scenarios without parameter with the parameters with the exponentials and with um, uh, the number more than the, the actual decimal point in this whole variable right so we have got all got to know all the Thanks all the scenarios with respect to two fixed in JavaScript. I hope that it helps you now and uh, this is how it work in JavaScript. So make sure that you practice it and uh, so that you are well versed with this function, right? So hope you guys uh, it helped and see you in the next video.